It was out of pocket. And for the longest, we had no idea what the problem was. And we just kept, we were begging, Mr. Vandross, can you please tell us what we did so we can apologize for it? Because we have no idea what it is that we did. Um, and just come to find out um, what he said to us. Now, if this is the real reason, I don't know, but this is what he said to us. It was the reason he gave us that he tortured us <laughs> for two months. <laughs> um, during that time, there was a TV show, Arsenio Hall. And mm -hmm. Arsenio was a platform that a lot of um, music artists had the opportunity to debut their music on and, and showcase their talent. And so um, he, Arsenio Hall, had always had us on the show. Every single we had, he was there for us. So anyway, it was his birthday. And Luther Vandross wanted us to, to uh, perform together and do a performance for Arsenio Hall. We loved the idea. We wanted to do it, but we couldn't do it. And we tried to figure out how to fit it into our schedule, and we just couldn't do it because we were rehearsing for his, his tour, actually, and it was a lot of work. Um, and we were also still doing a lot of press and touring ourselves. So, um, but we wanted to do something for Arsenio because he had been so supportive of us. So we thought, I tell you what, why don't we get a cake, run over to the studio, sing happy birthday, and then leave? Because we were in the process of rehearsing. And um, so that's what we did. And the day that we did it, Luther was there. So we showed up, we presented a birthday cake to um, Arsenio Hall, and we sang happy birthday. And then we left and went back to the studios to finish rehearsing for Luther's tour. And so come to find out, he was mad at us because he said, I asked you guys to, to do the show with me and perform with me and, and let's do it together. And we were like, but we couldn't do it. We couldn't make it work, but we didn't want to not honor Arsenio Hall because he had been yeah. so supportive for us. So we were there all of, it wasn't even an hour that we were there. We literally ran on set, gave him his birthday cake, said happy birthday and left. And um, that's why he was upset with us. It was petty. It was very <laughs> really petty. Nice. I mean, thank you for he, clearing that up. You really tortured us. On that tour. <laughs> we were so, so excited and so grateful that Luther had even asked us to go on tour with him. We couldn't wear any of the primary colors, what? black, white, red, no, no primary colors. We couldn't wear anything that was shiny, no shiny clothes, nothing. Um, and then while what we were in gray, we, it was crazy. When I tell you it was crazy, it was crazy. While we were performing, uh, we'd be on stage performing and all of a sudden our lights would disappear. Rude. Just take the lights. He wanted us to walk around the building to get to the stage as opposed to down the hall to the stage because we were passing his dressing room. We could not walk past his dressing room. He ordered our people to eat in the basement. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah. Of, of the venues because he didn't want us eating with his people. Um, it, it was pretty he went wild. hard. And you know what's crazy? In all of that, every night we watched his show like, oh my God, he's amazing. It is every night. Gross. Every night we watched the show in awe because he was incredible. <laughs> so we, well, we it sounds like up. you guys took the high road. We did. We took the high road. Absolutely. And we told him that we didn't, um, it wasn't our intention to not perform with him that we wanted to, but that because Arsenio has supported us for so many years, we just really wanted to quickly, you know, honor him and say thank you for all the support he had been given us. And, and we were um, sorry if that, offended him. And that's all we could do. <laughs>